Just last month of this cut. Please enter. Your good work has restored us to our former strength, Ezio. We are ready to strike. Just tell me what needs to be done, and I'll see that it is. You'll approach from above under the cover of night. Emilio has posted archers around the palazzo. Kill them, but do so quietly. As they fall, my men shall replace them. What about the guards? When you finish with the archers, we'll regroup in front of this building here. ...and discuss next steps. Nessun problema. I'll take care of the archers and return to you. Then it's settled. In Bocca al Lupo. Not you! 
Well done, Ezio. Everything is going according to plan. As we speak, my men are replacing the archers you've removed. The way to the palazzo is clear now. But not the building itself. Emilio's guards still patrol its border. Use my men. They can distract the guards. Save you from having to fight. And when it comes time to storm the place, remember what I've taught you. Seek out, though, Ezio. We await word of your success. Your little house of cards is crumbling, Emilio. A minor setback. It will be dealt with. This povero Scemo Antonio and his thieves... Never mind then. It's the assassin you should be worried about. Why? Is... Is he in Venezia? He's been here for weeks. How could you be so blind? Unlike you, I've been busy. Someone had to provide the weapons to our brothers in Firenze. Yes. And we also were good at it. Enough with the barbs. What is it you want, Carlo? <coughs> Maestro has called a meeting. Three days from now at Santo Stefano. <coughs> Very well. I'll be there. Assuming you still live. If you want my advice, 
I'd find a less conspicuous place to wait. Seta is a target now. Seta is a fortress. If you say so. Goodbye, Emilio. Cazzo, what if he's right? You, call for my boat. It should be close. When it arrives, load those crates and prepare to sail. I'll be right back. If Carlos is through, I must find a place to hide, just until the meeting. Then we'll deal with the assassin. He must be working with Antonio. That means the attacks... No. I've worked too hard for this. <clears throat> Peasants are not allowed up here! Don't they understand? There is so much less crime. The people have better lives. So some must leave. It is the price of progress. Why must the assassins always interfere? Like Giovanni. If he had just left well enough alone. You, stop the moment! Do not be afraid. I feel no fear, assassin. Only regret. I sought unity. Stability. Order. At too great a cost. Progress demands sacrifice. Non trova alcuna gioia in questo. Ma non c'è altro modo. Requiescat in pace. Sorry, <laughs> I couldn't resist. Come, let's open the gate for Antonio. Set has fallen and Emilio is no more. All thanks to you, Ezio. Go! Tear down Emilio's banners. Return what he has stolen from the people. Tell me, Ezio. How can I repay you for your service? Money's always nice. Easy enough. What else? Emilio was meeting with a man named Carlo. He looked to be a government official. Do you know him? Carlo Grimaldi. He sits on the Council of Ten. Why do you ask? What are you up to? I have a meeting to attend. <laughs> 